Welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 2 FemShep Edition. You wouldn't know it by uh, watching me play, but Mass Effect 2 is actually one of the most tricky of the three of the trilogy for me to let's play because I have very specific requirements of what I need from everybody. It's, uh, it's very tricky, but I'm not too worried. I know pretty much what I need to go to. I need to head to Ilium. I can find it behind this Ismar frontier. Alright, Ilium. Ilium is a very interesting place. Uh, it's actually one of my favorites. Just checking to see if I have everything I need. Looks like I do. Let's head on in. Ilium, a classic garden world developed to serve as an un enter post. I get an entrepot. I'm sorry, I don't know what that word means. Depot. Anyways, stuff. So here, I want to take along Miranda. And let's take along Kasumi for the fun of it. Okay, we seem to be all set for Femshep. For Kasumi, we probably want to upgrade Overload and Shadow Strike. Now, when Overload hits level 3, it actually gets a damping effect. Weapon, actually, it gets, uh, it gets the overheat ability from uh, Mass Effect 1, whatever it was called. And it overheats weapons. For you, I think we should probably just do this, and we should be all set. Weapons should be fine. Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Hey, that's kind of nice. That's a lot of firepower for a friendly welcome. Expecting trouble? We're the gateway to the Terminus systems, Commander. That element of risk requires greater security. Liara Tassoni vouched for your conduct and paid all fees you would normally incur. She also asked that I direct you to speak with her at your convenience. She's near the trading floor. Do you have any recommendations about what to do on Nosastra? Our trading center is directly ahead. You'll find restaurants and shops nearby as well. I suggest you browse our shopping kiosks. You can find things on Nosastra that you can't find anywhere else in the galaxy. What can you tell me about Nosastra? It's an exciting city. We see a lot of new cultures and goods because of our proximity to the Terminus systems. At the same time, Ilium is still in a sorry world. You should be as safe here as you would be on the Citadel. For your own safety, however, I recommend against signing anything. What's so dangerous about signing something? Ilium is a free trade world, Commander. Contract term requirements are more relaxed here than on other planets. It's a small price to pay for keeping our competitive edge in goods from the Terminus systems. You mentioned trading. What gets traded on Ilium? Anything you can imagine, Commander. Ilium is a wonderful world for those who can afford it. In order to remain competitive as a Terminus Systems port, we've relaxed many of the standards you'd find on other Asari worlds. Most drugs are legal, provided they are labeled properly. You can buy almost any weapon or technology. You can even buy indentured servants. I can't believe an Asari world would allow slavery. We try to avoid calling it slavery. All indentured servants on Ilium have voluntarily agreed to a term of service. Most choose indentured service as a means to pay off debt or avoid imprisonment. A contract holder is responsible for the well-being of her servants, and a servant's duties are agreed upon before the contract is signed. You said Liara was here? What is she doing? Liara is one of Nosastra's most respected information brokers. Nosastra is based upon trade. Information is valuable currency, and Liara has done quite well. As I said, you'll find her near the trading floor. She was looking forward to seeing you. I'm on a mission. Can you help me find someone? I can help you find major entertainment centers or stores, but I'm afraid I can't point you to individual people. 
Liara is excellent at that type of work, however. I imagine she can help you. Thank you. Again, welcome to our city, Commander. Please enjoy your stay. Customs records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port, Shepard. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane Krios, the assassin on your dossier, as well. Also, I have a message for Miss Lawson. Lantea has reserved a room at Eternity and will be waiting. Thank you, Edie. Well, it sounds like our first stop would be to talk to Liara. My, uh, one of my favorite people in the entire trilogy. What was Vista? Maybe I still haven't gotten it. Yes, I still haven't gotten it. Here we are. You have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. Ilium is quite the place. Quite the place indeed. Very, very nice looking. Pardon me, I'm on a call. I know. Pardon me, I'm on a call. Man. Not very talkative, are you? Just because you're on a call. 25. Sell at 25. No, no, no. You're not hearing me. I want to buy it up. Buy it all up. Come on, come on. Give me something. Trading. Hmm. Towers, traffic, lights, and Asari everywhere you look. I thought about living here for a while, but everybody's so tight ass. It's all about money to these people. I do what I do for the love of it. These people do it because they don't know any better. <laughs> Are you shorting prefabs? Why not? I did it after Eden Prime. Paid for new exosuits for my kids. You're insane. Shorting prefabs, huh? The, this is actually a really interesting world. If you take the time and go and listen to all of these conversations, extremely Holy interesting. Crap, Shepard? I thought you were dead. Shepard? The news said you were dead. What happened? No, wait, probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. I'm Gianna Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. You screwed over my corruption investigation of Administrator Analeas. I was worried about bigger problems at the time. Saren was trying to destroy the galaxy. No kidding. And using our labs for his experiments. Man, we caught some heat over that one. Anyway, I eventually got Analeas fired for screwing an Asari tax inspector, so it worked out. Have a seat. You can buy me a beer. What brings you to Ilium? You know, that you can talk about. Nothing I can talk about. No offense, but Novaria was dealing with the enemy last time. Damn, you're a hard ass. I'd forgotten that. Hey, listen, I just remembered something. I've got to go. Talk to you later. And don't forget to drink your beer. Hmm. Shepard had to leave. Target saw me. Couldn't break cover. A sorry merchant smuggling schematics from Novaria. Can you talk her into showing you good stuff? Are you still ordering me around, Jonah? Well, who's this merchant we need to talk to? I'm looking for the best tech upgrades you have. Of course. I can help you with a consult and figure out what options work for you. Welcome. You look like someone who needs high-quality equipment. Feel free to look around. My store has the best tech and biotic equipment on Ilium. How do I know this stuff is any good? You're an Asari. Maybe your stuff is no good for humans. I carry nothing but the best. I offer a money-back guarantee. That doesn't help when I'm dead due to equipment failure. Look, I'm dropping too many credits to screw around here. Well, perhaps I could give you a preferred rate at the kiosk. Here, a small discount, and when I get special items in, you can take a look. What kind of special items are we talking about? Oh, you know, schematics, designs. Nothing illegal, but I may not have all the licenses to sell them. An internal affairs agent from Novaria is trying to catch you dealing with smuggled goods. Parasini? Hell, thanks for the warning. I'm gonna get lost and remove some evidence. I'll program the kiosk to offer you a discount, though. Where the hell am I gonna go next, Omega? <laughs> well, I guess I can screw over Parasina again. 
What have we got? Medigel capacity upgrade. Got plenty of credits. Uh, bio amp upgrade. Not really that useful to me, but hey. Doubles time limit for bypass. A little more useful. Medigel capacity. Not bad. What else have we got? And can we talk to Parasini again? Again, I ask for your help, and again, you screw me over. I don't know why I bother. Because it's fun! It's just wonderful fun. Okay, what else do we have? I need minimal heat increase. And speed. I have extremely high performance requirements. Certainly, sir. The safe, too. I need a 100% safety guarantee of anything going on to my suit. Okay, extremely high performance guarantee. I'm not sure that he really needs that much performance. How can you short sell on prefabs after these human colony attacks? They're going to see a ton of business. A ton of immediate charity business, followed by a freeze as new colony plans dry up. Just watch. So, so. Hmm. Okay. Let's actually do a thing. The first place we want to go to is over in this direction. We need to go find Another Liara. development for human expansion as the colony on Horizon has been attacked. The Council has pledged to investigate the matter thoroughly as a possible indication of attacks on humans galaxy-wide. Investors in prefabricated complexes are rejoicing, however, as the repair and rebuilding plans have spiked shares industry-wide. Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. You're Liara's assistant? Yes. Liara relies upon me to acquire useful intelligence. I don't have her network of contacts, but I supply her with supplemental data. It's really an honor to work with her. What's Liara's reputation here on Ilium? She is greatly respected. In a few short years, she's amassed a sizable network of connections. She could have even more political power than she already wields, if she weren't so focused on her personal goals. But I believe she should tell you about that, not me. I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. You talk weirdly. Anyways, Liara! Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I'll make it simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Shepard! Nixeris, hold my calls. That's awkward. This is why I prefer to not have a helmet. My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. You're threatening to flay people alive now? Oh, that. That was just a customer unhappy with the information he received. He'll pay. They always do. Ever since I helped you stop Saren, people have wanted to be my friend. Or not be my enemy. I've set up a respectable business as an information broker. It's paid the bill since you... Well, for the past two years. And now you're back, gunning for the Collectors with Cerberus. If you know that, then you know that I could use your help. I can't, Shepard. I'm sorry. I have commitments here, things I need to take care of. If you can't join me, would you be willing to give me some information? Of course. Who or what are you looking for? I'm looking for Thane Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The Assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nisana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena has an office in the cargo transfer levels. Perhaps she can tell you where Krios is. That was all just off the top of your head? I'm a very good information broker, Shepard. The world of intrigue isn't that different from a dig site. Except that the dead bodies still smell. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with Tracking Officer Dara. You can find Dara at the Transportation Hub. Why would Samara have to register with a Tracking Officer? 
Is she a criminal? No. In fact, she's quite the opposite. Samara is a Justicar, one of an ancient sect of Asari warriors. Dara can tell you more. Thanks for the help. That's all I needed to know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know. How's your own work going? It's busy. It's... crazy. It would be so easy to join up with you. Like old times. But these aren't old times. I have commitments here. Things I need to take care of. What kind of things do you need to take care of? Are you in trouble? No, no trouble. But it's been a long two years. I had things to do while you were gone. I have debts to repay. Listen, if you want to help, I need someone with hacking expertise. Someone I can trust. If you could disable security at key points around Ilium, you could get me information I need. That would help me a great deal. What's this all about, Liara? Can't you just talk to me? Don't you think I want to, Shepard? This isn't because I don't trust you. This is Ilium. Anything I say is probably being recorded. Hacking a terminal sounds pretty easy. Why do you need me? I don't know anyone else I can trust. Hacking the security node won't get you the data. It just creates a minor glitch in the system. You'll have a short time to find a local server left vulnerable by that glitch, and upload the data to my system. I'm leaving my own system vulnerable so that the data can be imported during that short time. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data from there, if you hurry. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. I'll talk to you later, Liara. Okay, you can also ask about the Shadow Broker, but that is DLC, so... I'm just not gonna do anything with that for a bit. What in the world? Hello, Nexaris. Aren't you supposed to be at your desk? Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. Okay, that's just trippy. I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. I haven't seen that one before. Anyways. Let's head out this way. I'm not sure if this is where I want to go first or not, but, uh... We'll at least figure it out soon. I know the data is vital to the Kurosa family. The Sana Dantius didn't give us time to pack. I'm lucky I got out at all. Her mercenaries were starting to shoot. If she lets us back in, I'll get it, I promise. If not, well, we'll just have to hope. Asana Dantius, huh? Well, we're gonna have to deal with Nasana at some point. Is this where I want to be? I think this is where I want to be. I think this is... close to where I want to be. Serena? Who wants to know? Someone who can make your life a living hell. <laughs> Too late. Liara Tassoni said you'd have information on Thane Krios. Am I wasting my time? Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? I just need to talk to him. Dangerous man to chat with. Your call, though. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. If you work there, you must have an idea what his opposition will be. Eclipse Mercs. High-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well-equipped. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. Why does that name sound familiar? She was a representative on the Citadel a few years ago. Right. She had me kill her sister, the slaver. I thought that was just a rumor. Well, you know what she's capable of, then. She has even more power here in Nos Astra. She uses it to keep her friends in check, and her enemies dead. So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1.
There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. That doesn't sound like Nasana's just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. I'll be back in a bit. I'll be here, but I wouldn't wait too long. All right. We will want to do that in a minute, but let's see. We got some renegade for that. Uh, let's head in this doorway over here. See what we've got. 